hands of the kind shepherd had little interest in peace. Chieftain, the tribe needs more room. Build more shelters. Grunwa is ready. Enemies are attacking! Enemies are attacking! is listening. Zazka is right at home. <laughs> what now? More trouble? Enemies 
are attacking! Zazka is listening. What should he do? What should he do for the tribe? Probably. Ready for action. Huh. <laughs> 
What now? More trouble? Akrog is waiting now. You don't see that. Akrog is listening. <sighs> Alright. He thinks that was all of them. But still no sign of the dragon. It must be in the cave. Grimoire can feel an incredible hex power coming from down there. Hex power and pain. That poor thing. Well fought, Chieftain Akrog. His bravery brings the Moonkin and Magwa honor. Trust in one crumple. Oh, no, I get worried. It was Noag who fought, so Crumb should have been the one to worry. As Grunwar said, the dragon must be down there, as is their leader, this kind shepherd. Crumb thinks he will not give in easily. They should enter with crushed sticks ready. This kind shepherd knows Grunwar what he can do. What hexes can he weave? Grunwar knows not. But he has lived an unusually long time for a brittle bone, so he must have the gift of gloom or the gift of blood, necromancy or demonology, as the brittle bones call them. Still, they will handle it. Akrog is surprised this kind shepherd was not with his kin for the fight. They crushed their entire temple. He must be a coward. Typical brittle bone, big mouths when they hide behind their walls and contraptions, but puny and shrieking when one swings a crush stick at them. Still, Crum is right. He has been the Scion's leader for a long, long time, so he must be a strong hexer. They should be wary. Mm. Worry not. They will be. All right. Then there is no time to waste. Time to free this dragon. Hex power, crackling in the ground, seeping from the walls, clinging to the air. With every step the trolls took into that dwarven temple, the power grew. What would they find down there? The kind shepherd or the dragon? Hmm. This is vast. Bigger even than Akrog thought. True. To think how long it must have taken to build this. That dragon, no? Tusks, it sounds sad. No creature should be slave, no. Wise words, trusted one. Wise words. Remember, Chieftain, provoke her not. Just let Crumb talk to her. He is not as Can sweet a as he looks. Rest for a moment. Trust Zazka. Grumwa is ready. Zazka is listening. You are ready. This water, it has hex power, no? It brims with it, almost like Magwa's tears or her blood. The dwarves must be using it for something then. Wait! Kick them out! Kick them out of the sanctum! water through this place it is true but where comes it from and where leads it that is what the moon can need to find out the dragon what are they doing to it quick chieftain they need to find it <sighs> be moved at his service 
Grungwa is here. Curse it. That's the Gunters. Protect the Shepherd! Bring them to the moonlit river. Is that their chieftain? He seems to... to sleep. <laughs> and he stink like corpse. Uh, rotten. This world. Rotten. Must prevail. What is this? He looks... dead. Undead. Maybe this is... someone else. This cannot be the kind shepherd. Then who else would he be? Look at all these loops and spirit wards he is wearing, trusted one. Also, this looks like their heart of the tribe. Laska speaks true. This must be the kind shepherd they all worship. Dwarf, can he hear them? Riches, not succumb to... Temptation and riches, they... they... Listen to Big Blood! Rotten... this world... rotten... must prevail... No point, Chieftain. Grungwa thinks he hears them not. Water all leads to this point, no? Uh, my world. Shine. Prevail. Uh, the chieftain speaks true. Maybe. Oh no. No, no, no. What wrong, trusted one? Because this hex water is the dragon's, is it not? Crumb fear so. Chieftain, they need to find the dragon right now and crush these contraptions. They. No! Must prevail! Must prevail! He's attacking! Crush him! Prevail! Prevail! He is drawing from the head's water! Crush the contraption! is here. My word will shine! from the Hex Water! Crash the contraption! Now! Now! My... My vision! He is dead. The dragon! They must find the dragon! A Krog understands not. The kind shepherd was a bold man? An undead. It seems like it. Grungwa guesses the Scions kept him alive through the hex water from the dragon. Huh. The undead kind shepherd. Hmm. But to what end? What was this vision he spoke of? Crumb wants not to disrespect the chieftain, but why matters it right now? They must save the dragon. 
Who knows what they did to it when they realized the Moonkin had won the battle? All right. It must be close. You find out. What this? Zazka is listening. You're ready. Ready for our text. Going now. What now? I think I he's ready. This. Go on here. What is this? Can Zazka help? Wongo Boo! What should he do? Tusks. It... It looks so powerful. And beautiful. Oh, poor, poor thing. Can it hear them? Zaska thought dragons could speak. They normally can, but look what they did to her. Sucked out her blood to feed their rotten chieftain. Crum will tame her chieftain. He will, and then the Moonkin will nurse her back to health. Perhaps they will not even need Zarak's cub then. She... It is a doe. Crum believes so, it is true. But it matters not. Fine. But he will be careful. Of course. God smash! It is over, little one. No one will hurt her again. The crumb told them, no? Trust must start somewhere. Now. No! Oh, tusks. Crush it! Crush it! Fight at full strength. Killed Crumb, curse it! It killed Crumb! Crumwa knows. Trust him. He knows. Talk to Noag, Akrog. Now. <sighs> Akrog will take care of it. Mm. <sighs> Wonderful. Now talk to Noag. He needs him. See? This has Brittlebone words on it. Akrog should let Grumwar know about this. Come back! Come back, Grumpy! Please! Crumb swims in the moonlit river now, little blood. He... He suffers not. Come back! Come back! died for the tribe, little blood. Akrog knows this helps not with his dark thoughts, 
But Noag must find strength in that. He must. Come. Come back. The wound is still too fresh, Chieftain. They should speak to him later. It is a rotten nightmare. There is not even flesh of him to take back to the tribe. <clears throat> the Songbone. They must take the Songbone at least. He would not want it to grow moss here. It is true. Akrog is listening. That is it. Akrog should show the scales of Grungwar. Then they can leave. Can Sasuke help Grungwar? Another altar. But it has no... Mm, Grungwar sees. <laughs> this is a recipe. All right. I'll let him see. Mm, this has a lot of hex power. Or what about the chieftain? Can he... can he feel an echo? Akrog can. A strong one. Well, oh, great. This will surely bring Krum back to life. Can they get out of here now? A heartbeat longer in this rotten place, and Zaska will lose it. They will leave. Come, little blood. There is nothing else they can do. Oh, Krum. When Akrog told the Moonkin warriors waiting in the desert what had happened, their first response was confusion and not grief. Krom dead? Much like Chieftain Narjak, many kin deep down had thought the gentle shepherd unkillable. Much like Chieftain Narjak, it would take them days to realize he was not. Zazka is listening. Akrog the Chieftain, how can Grungwa help? Akrog has... Hmm, and here they are. Well, Magwa prays. Noak's heart feel all strong now. Can't do that? Indeed. Grungwa thinks the Tear needs no more bone dust from here on out. This will last it a moon, or even two. He thanks the Chieftain again for his help. All this, it... <sighs> no point in getting all sentimental. This will be a glorious totem for the tribe camp to last, Chieftain. Grangwa knows it. Mm. Of course, duty awaits. Yes. Chieftain, uh, Zeramak must shape something. Look. Still? Still? Will? Across. Well, oh, how incredibly amusing, Arthur. What do you need, Sir Troll? What can he do for the tribe? Lovely rain. <sighs> what is needed of him? Can a troll not rest for a moment? Take care of it. Be not worried. <laughs> Mugwa praise. Bit nice day.
What should he do? That frog is ready. Keep the run the farm. Back. Come back. All right. Let's take a look at this scale. At his service. There you have it. The Echo of Knowledge. Hmm. This is it. Is he sure? Why? Nothing. Well then, it is time. The tribe for the blood, the blood for the tribe. Shepherd Krom kind soul, may Magwa guide him into the moonlit river. Akrog is Chieftain the... Akrog? He asked Akrog to look out for traces of the sacred... Hmm. Well, the plot thickens. This is enough to keep me busy for a short while, but do bring me anything else you find. Hmm. Akrog will see what he can find. Akrog found an echo. Can the stranger take a look? Grunwa is ready. Let Akrog see. What is it? Insert the Echo Shaper into the Nexus Point. Akrog tried. Nothing happened. What? No. That's impossible. I'm telling you, this is the Echo of Knowledge. It must work. Well, it worked not. Akrog had this feeling ever since they picked up the scale. This Echo, Knowledge, it is strong, but not what they need. It is not the dark echo of whatever the Hex Gate to the Masked Goddess's temple uses. But the Hunters and the Chainers, they have no time. Akrog knows. This is the Brittlebones doing, is it not? He did it on purpose, so they would lose their shepherd and die. <sighs> Shocking. You figured me out. Mm, uh, the Brittlebone will not mock Guangwa. Claus, I made a mistake, all right? I made a mistake, and that's that. Don't you see it's a miracle we got this far at all? I... I must have misread the Shaper Glyphs on those tablets. That's the only explanation. I will read them again, then we try another aspect. That's the only way. Well, maybe the stranger can kindly ask the hunters to help him read then. Because in a sun-up or two, this place will be swarming with them. Well then, just go elsewhere and hide. We'll figure something out. And leave this place to the hunters? The stranger thinks they will just let them saunter back in here one. Tired. So tired. Little blood? No, I'm tired of having be strong. So tired of fight. It never work. He never protect. Trolls always die. For sire. Then crumple. Why, big blood? Why no I can trust it once cannot live peace? Why everyone always want to kill them, hurt them, rip out tusks? Monkey not animals! They're not dirt, they trolls! And trolls want live! Little blood, it is. it is alright. Lie! Nothing is all right. Nothing ever is all right. Sire dead. Nog dead. Sleek dead. Crumple dead. So many Moonkin dead just because no one ever leave them alone. Crumple. He always kind. He always nice. He never hurt anyone. And now he dead. 
like everyone else. It's not fair. But no, I can no give up. Let them come, Big Blood. Let hunters come, and Norag will protect Moonkin, every single one. He protect, and he fight, even when they rip out his tusks. Even if he know they'll die because hunters are too many. He protect. Noag, the Songbone. 